So if we move on to the vulvar biopsy, this is a vulvar punch biopsy instrument. It is four millimeters in its uh, diameter. And what I recommend is that you teach the students to use this, the banana on the skin of the banana to perform the biopsy. So normally we would have infiltrated the skin and uh, provided some local anesthesia for the patient with 1% lidocaine. And once the area where you are going to biopsy is adequately anesthetized, then you will apply the um, vulvar biopsy at a 90 degree angle like this. Um, and holding it at its tip like this, uh, just realizing that the metal part has a blade on the end, so careful not to touch that, otherwise you will cut yourself, and apply it directly firmly onto the vulvar skin. And just realize you're not going to be embedding this entire metal portion of the vulvar punch biopsy into the vulvar skin. Otherwise you leave a very large defect and it will bleed and it will be very uncomfortable for the patient. So you only want to see a part of the metal portion disappear into the vulvar skin. So in a screwing fashion like this, you're gently going to apply pressure and then pull straight out like that. And at the tip of the vulvar uh, biopsy instrument should be your tissue right at the tip of this. Um, now sometimes it can actually be left in the bed of the vulva and at this point you would have um, iris scissors and tooth pickups in order to uh, obtain the sample and then again send it in a, in a jar like this with formalin for pathology. Okay.